Welcome to Evernote for iPhone and iPod Touch. First, either sign in or create your free Evernote account. Let's jump in. Let's start by creating a new note. To create a new note, tap on the plus. Let's title our note. Tap into the title area and type something. Then tap into the note body to add some text. Tap on the keyboard icon to reveal more options. Tap on the voice note to start recording. You can even add text as you record audio. To finish recording, tap again on the voice note icon. You can record up to 90 minutes of audio. You can also attach snapshots or images from your camera roll. You can attach a single image or multiple images at once. To attach multiple images, tap on the arrow icon and then select the images. Tap on the notebook option to assign this note to a notebook. Tap on tags to assign tags. And view your location. You can even change the location of this note. Then hit save and this note will synchronize with every other version of Evernote that you use. Now let's take a look at how to browse and search through your notes. To browse through all of your notes, tap all notes. To browse by notebook, tap on notebooks, tags for tags, and if you want to search through your notes, tap on the search screen. Here you can do a search or perform a search that you've saved using Evernote on your desktop. Your saved searches will be listed on this screen. And don't forget about Evernote's amazing search technology. Take a snapshot using your iPhone of a whiteboard or napkin scribble or wine label and Evernote will make it all searchable. Now, let's look at some other ways to find your notes. Return to the All Notes view and tap on the 2x2 two two squares in the top right corner of the screen. Brings up Resource Views. First up, Images. This view shows you all of the images contained in all of your notes. Next, Attachment View. This shows you only the attachments contained inside of your notes so you can easily open exactly what you're looking for. And finally, Map View. This view lets you see all of your notes that contain location data on a map. Tap on the pin to view the notes. Evernote also works in Landscape View. Turn your phone on its side, and you can still browse through all of your notes. Here, swipe left and right to view your notes. If you're an Evernote Premium subscriber, then you can choose notebooks to be stored offline, allowing you to access them when you don't have a network connection. You can do this from the settings menu. And if you're a free user, then any note that you view, create, or favorite will be stored offline as well. And those are just some of the ways that you can use Evernote for iPhone and iPod Touch. Get it now from the iTunes App Store.